much. Um, we've got time for one more quick question and a very brief response. Yes, there's a question here. Thank you. I have this question for John. Um, how do you think of this statement? Democracy is the best system to deliver peace, cohesion, and consequently prosperity, and that is because rulers, those in power, are elected. So they are more responsive to the needs of the people. They could rule because they have the consent of the people, because they have the consent of the governed. So I think democracy is great, but I think more important than democracy is you have a government that's willing to address the needs and the grievances of the everyday people, one that has good checks and balances, and a government that has regular leadership transitions. So I'll look at China, and one of the reasons why I like what the government has done is in 1989, only 65% of Chinese females were literate, versus about 85% of Chinese males. Now the number for Chinese born after 1989, it's 99.7% for males and 99.6% for females. In 1989, the average per capita GDP of India, uh, India and China both were about 300. China right now is 9,100 US dollars, while India is only 1,850. So China has done something right in the last 30 years. They are addressing the grievances and the needs of the everyday Chinese, which would be food, education, a way to move up economically. And there have been good leadership transitions since 1989, and there have been checks and balances. It hasn't been through a vote, through the wide population, but it has been through the elites. And there has been more balance of power under the Jiang Zemin, the Hu Jintao administrations than a lot of people give credit for. You know, again, you look, Boris Johnson was directly elected by 160,000 people. He wasn't elected by all, every single British person. Right, and there will be a chance for the British people to have their say, sure. <laughs> is the great difference. Anyway, thank you very much. I'm afraid we're out of time. Joshua Wong, Sean Ryan, thank you very much.